Been seeing this cat Ben Baller around all over the place. Always flashy, always crazy, but I honestly don't know what this motherfucker does. He's just always in the middle of some shit. Ben Baller. My name is Ben Baller, and I'm a celebrity jeweler. Kanye West to Drake, Nas, Wale, Tyga, and then you have people like Justin Bieber, who's the biggest star in the world, to Michael Jackson, dealing with actors like Tom Cruise, Dr. Phil, and just random, you know, Saudi princes, billionaires who hit me up. I have NBA, NFL players like Reggie Bush, Olympic athletes, Apollo Ono, professional skaters like Ryan Sheckler, actresses and actors, musicians, Kim Kardashian, just so many different people. Ben Baller is a jeweler, entrepreneur, ex-sneaker collector, car connoisseur. People might think he's cocky. Really, he's just a normal, cool dude. I'm a Korean-American, Angelino, because I was born and raised here in Los Angeles, Koreatown. Been a love of sports, hip-hop, Los Angeles culture, art, graffiti, diamonds. Just the LA life, I'm about it, 100%. My foundation's always been hip-hop since back in the 80s. I was an executive over at Priority Records, so while I was there when we signed Jay-Z, it was first album deal. Those relationships, especially being involved in such such monumental projects in hip hop, working with Dr. Dre early and being hooked up with the coolest people from underground rap to huge rap stars, me DJing the Black Oscar party, meeting Quincy Jones and Mary G. Blige and Tupac, just running around Tupac and just the stories I have with him, just being around greatness, you know. I understood what and what not to do with artists. That helped me really open that door. The name says it all, man. Iced out, the whips, cash, diamonds. Being in the music business involved into my joy business. My uncle, my cousin, they brought me into the business. They showed me the basics. And then from there, all those connections, those people and the respect they have for me then, they know I strive for excellence. So they see that I'm putting together some fly shit for Pusha T. And then people are like, oh, I just seen that on him and I want to get right. It's like a chain reaction. Ben Baller? He's a decent guy, but you know, sometimes he could get out of control. He's just an all around high end schmuck. <laughs> I have regular folks who come in and spend a crazy amount of money for jewelry. $50,000, $45,000, $50,000. It's a quarter million dollars, half a million dollars, $600,000. As far as awareness goes, the internet is crucial. It's so important to my business and my brand. Man, you be on Instagram, man. You, you don't even know your past, man. He's a legend in these streets, man. I be seeing him with Mariah Carey, Run DMC, Slick right. Rick. I'm the swag champ. I'm the coach. Ben Ball is a superstar. He got a big head, about like that. And then he has a little... Anybody. The only insecurities I have is my long ass face. If my head was a little smaller, I'd probably be 10 times more famous. But you know what that means? Big brain. This guy navigates from the hood to white Hollywood. Paris Hilton of the game. He's a guy that people love to hate. I am one confident, cocky ass son of a bitch. I've been hated on since Show and Tell Friday, since I was in kindergarten. I know who I am. I don't give a fuck. Know it all, back up everything I say. Passionate, hardworking, crazy, talented. Very blessed human being. Everyone knows Ben, and everyone knows Ben's crazy. To anybody who thinks I'm an ignorant, stupid son of a bitch, and this piece of shit, or whatever, I just say, my pee pee hurts. Like Drake said, diss me, you never get a reply for it. Ben's awesome. He's really smooth, really fast. He's really funny. Whenever I come to any kind of big decisions in my life where I need to buy jewelry, he's definitely the guy that I call. I've never met anyone else like him. He's Ben Baller. <laughs>